So I bought this. And this is down my neck. It's, it's a brand new brush. It costs like 10 bucks. And I have no idea how it's going to work. So I need to get... I need to get some scissors. pretty good. My other one was had it. So I'll just show you what my other one looks like. I've had the other one for like oh, it must have been two years I guess. And I find it really I found it really really difficult to to brush my hair and it's like this is the reason why. <laughs> Literally no little plastic ends on this. More than half of them are gone. So it's a really well used brush, so I'm replacing it with this one that I bought from the chemist. This one I bought online. It's like a $35 brush that I bought for like 15 bucks or something. And this one's a $10 brush, so... This one's thicker, but this one's thicker, probably more heavy duty. But they should be similar. If it doesn't work, I'll just buy another one online. Because that's where you get all your expensive things for on cheap. I always get good bargains online. I'm gonna take this uh, this thing off. That is some sort of band, so totally replacing. Look, it's getting serious now. I'm totally like leaving the band across so that this is officially my new one. I don't know if you have to rinse them though before you start brushing your hair. I guess I should. Usually I just use them, so I, I guess you don't really need to, but. Sometimes I do. But this one's a lot sturdier since it's got a thicker handle. And this one's like, oh my gosh, it's anorexic. <laughs> skinny, skinny version. So this one would have lasted for longer. I just can't, my, my hair doesn't brush when it doesn't have little balls, ball things on top. It just doesn't brush my hair. And I was like, oh. So you really need these plastic bits. But I guess... I'm guessing this one's only going to last a year, whereas this one lasted two years, so. But we'll see. 